Some residents in the Sunland Park and Santa Teresa area are frustrated following elevated pH levels in their water. For many people, this is causing the water to feel slick and slimy, and it's been like this for the past few days. ABC 7's Rosemary Montañez spoke with those addressing the issue and joins us live from Santa Teresa. Rosemary. Yeah, Paul, some residents I spoke with say they've been forced to use drinking water as well as using it for their day to day activities. Many residents telling me they were forced to change their routine as a result of this water situation. Now, CRUA or the Camino Real Regional Utility Authority is the one who provides a water service here. The executive director says this all started around three days ago. He says a pump in the arsenic treatment plant didn't shut off like it was supposed to when the wells were turned off. So it continued to pump sulfuric acid into the system. That's what raised the pH levels. When they found out, staff was sent out and they were able to shut off that source. Since then, the company says they started to flush lines and drain tanks. I, of course, spoke with impacted customers. It's been like slimy. Like uh, my mom and me took a shower and I just kept like trying to rinse out my hair and it just felt like I just had conditioner, even if I was just like rinsing it out. And then like my brother, he turned on the water and it was like a little bit not clear. <laughs> And the director says they continue to test the water. The Sullivan Park Fire Department is also assisting during this time. But I do want to mention about 15 minutes ago, my photographer and I both got an alert on our phones. It says residents are advised to not use water for drinking, washing dishes or bathing. I'm reporting live in Santa Teresa, Rosemary Montañez, ABC 7. Thank you for that update, Rosemary.